Even with the inch of rain Duluth received on Monday, 2020 is still Duluth's driest year on record through this date. Now, I spoke with DNR officials about what could happen if this trend continues and what you can do to prevent spreading fire. October is the fourth busiest month of the year for us. With October historically being one of Minnesota's worst months for wildfires, Minnesota DNR officials are already seeing a noticeable uptick in fires in the last week. You get those nice warm days, but then they get a little bit of wind with them, and then we have fuels that are dry and ready to go, and, and uh, that produces some windows for opportunity. The DNR says October's dryness is just like the conditions we see in April. With nights that go below freezing, grass doesn't take up the moisture it normally does, creating fuel for fires to start. There's less moisture in the fuels, and so you have a lot of things that kind of come together to add up to, uh, you know, potential. Just in Duluth, we are 10 inches below a normal year of precipitation, making a typically dry season that much more dangerous. The grass and the brush that are laying right on the ground, and they can dry out uh, significantly within a couple of hours. And so if you get the right air mass and the right winds coming through, you can be dry even though we just had rain. Uh, things can dry out very quickly. Now, Bonnie, DNR officials are advising you use extra precaution when you make a campfire by making sure the fire is out completely as it could flare up up to 10 days after you think it is out. Good advice. All right, Ryan, thank you.